Hi, I'm Jack Hill, and this is Trailers from Hell. And I'm going to introduce a film of mine that some people consider my best film. It was my second film, and it's called Pit Stop. The original title was The Winner. Unfortunately, when the picture was about to be released, there was a big car racing movie at Universal called Winning. So we changed the title to Pit Stop, and there's no pit stop in the movie. But I think it's a pretty good title anyway. And the film was shot in black and white, and I call it the last great action movie in black and white because by the time it was finished, after many delays, drive-in theaters were not showing black and white films anymore other than as second features to a color picture. But it has had an interesting history since then, since it became available on home video. It has found a cult following, and a lot of people think of it as my best work, and in some ways it really is. I had uh, very much control in this picture, which I didn't normally have, and uh, I could do something very interesting with it. So let's take a look at the trailer. The story was about figure eight racing. Now, when I first started doing this movie, I had never heard of figure eight racing. Oh, but when I first saw it, I thought to myself, this is something so crazy, so loony, that it's got to become uh, almost like a documentary for a period of time and a place which will never happen again. And I thought that people all over the world, especially in Europe and in Asia, would see this and they'd think, boy, this is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Unfortunately, it has never been shown until recently outside the country because of that darn black and white. But actually, the black and white is perfect for it. So I don't really feel sorry for it at all. It has a very interesting cast. It has my favorite little actress, Beverly Washburn from Spider Baby, and Dick Davalos, who played James Dean's brother in East of Eden. And of course, my favorite actor of all time, Sid Haig. This was one of many pictures that I did with Sid. And the film stars Brian Donlevy, who at that time was the only sort of name actor that we had. Uh, Ellen McRae, we see her in here, that is uh, known today as Ellen Burstein, and this was, I believe, her first feature film. And another interesting thing about it is, uh, besides that crazy racing, is something we'll never see again, and that is the dune buggy races, uh, which are now uh, forbidden because they're so destructive to the environment. But there's a whole long scene with that in here that's just absolutely incredibly beautiful. This was all shot in a racetrack in Los Angeles which doesn't exist anymore. For the first time, just in the last uh, couple of years, the film has been showing at film festivals in Europe and other places, which has made me very happy because I always thought that uh, Europeans would think of this as a, as a totally crazy American-only type of film, and it turns out that they do. So uh, I wish it luck, and uh, it's available on DVD, and uh, try to catch it if you can.